Hello, 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 and welcome to, why well, yes, it is 4 a.m. Thank you for asking. Sometimes I wake really, wake up really early because my body's still in, like, a mode from four years ago where I used to wake up at 3 a.m. to go to work. Good times. Anyway, here's a bunch of fights that, I mean... I've been doing really well. Jenna has been hard carrying me. Like, pretty, pretty good. All things considered. Um, so I'm here to show you some of them in an appetizing fashion. Um, anyway, this one. They go for Laia, Sharoon. I don't know why they went for Sharoon. Uh, Arwell, uh, Stene, and Aravi. I went for Genoa, Bunny Dom, Shu, Flitica, and Strays. They get rid of Strays, I get rid of Laia. And we jump right into things. Flitica's gonna go first. Flitica is going to reset everybody. And by reset everybody, I mean defense break everybody. Which is always great to see. I'm gonna reset the Sharoon. Uh, because... I'm more worried about her attack down than anything else. Um, she can stun some people, sure. But I'm gonna go ahead and put attack down on everybody. Genoa's H3 into Arwell. And Stenny's already half dead. And then I'm gonna kill Arwell so I don't have to worry about um, that stun. If they want to soul burn, they can they can soul burn. They can do as they please. So they get the stun on the Genoa. And then the proc his his S2, I guess. They soul burn, but I have Bunny Dom. So that's fine. They don't waste their S3, which is perfectly acceptable by me. I'm just gonna keep going into Sharoon. Hey Ravi can do what she wants. Um because Stene still in danger from Shu, but I'm just going to keep working on Sharoon. I accidentally put her to sleep, but she's going to die anyway, so I don't particularly care. There she goes. The Flitiga, let's go ahead and blind... A Ravi, and then put her to sleep. I soul burn just in case. So she's asleep. There we go. And Shu gets to annihilate A Ravi's HP. And kill Stene in the process. And then they and then they concede. Good job, everybody. Shu's a Shu's gross. <laughs> Shu's also gross. Um, then we have against Reki. Uh, they have a bunch of units. It's Cleave. A different Cleave. A weird Cleave. But I get rid of, um, Goliath because she's the only one that can really, like, kill anybody. So. Everyone else is very, very slow at killing. So Pyra is going to do as Pyra does, which is S2, S3. I don't particularly mind. This is all quite okay. Rowan's going to S3, push everybody back. Sure, sure, sure. It is going to proc Mr. Wild Captain, though. Zeo, I don't know why they soul burn this, but they do. Soul burning doesn't really do anything. I think they push back Karu. They push back Genoa. It didn't do that much, because... I don't have a lot of HP. They just S1 to Genoa because... Um, to try and stun me, but... Genoa's gonna go ahead and kill Zeo. Eh, get close enough to Zeo. Um, and now... 
I can put immunity up on Genoa. I don't care about immunity on everybody else. Doesn't really matter too much. Uh, Flitica can kill Karina if she, if she so chooses. I'm perfectly fine with that. Karina is not how I win this game at this point. Genoa is absolutely how I win this game at this point. Um, plus, this gives me a bigger opportunity to be able to attack with Genoa. So I'm just going to try to kill Rowana. I don't need to cleanse anything. So now Rowana's dead. And now they have very little damage against Genoa. And if Genoa gets to go against Blitica, she's probably going to die. She does good damage. The escort buff is pulling a lot of weight. Um, but now it's like... Laia just kills. <laughs> oh, Jenna was so fun. Exactly. And then I fought Carol from Princess Reconnect. Uh, they went for... Uh, sea Lily, Arwal, uh, AOL... LHC and Rylet. I went for Genoa, which they banned. The coward. Um, Bunny Dom, Laia, Stene, and Yoha, because they have almost no damage. And Laia S3 can kill Rylet through evasion, and Yoha S3 can kill Rylet through evasion, so they have about 64k HP worth, worth of bulk. To get through to get to my Stene with just a Rylet. So, uh, I don't expect great things. They're gonna ho go ahead, proc Bunny Dom, and then S2 for funsies. I am just gonna give everybody an attack buff, because why not? Uh, and then just gonna S1. It's a resistance R um resistance AOL, which is fine. Just gonna try to work on her first, because she's the biggest pain in the butt. Arwell, I believe, tries to stun Lila. See Lilia. Um which she does. That's fine. Just gets a barrier. Can I provoke the AOL? No, okay, so it is a resistance AOL. So probably about 100 ER, 100, or like 150 ER, 150 effectiveness, because it doesn't do anything with her S3, which I'm okay with. They're just going to keep working on Laia, but Yoha is, you know, absorbing a lot of damage. Uh, let's put C. Lilius to sleep? Nope, resist. I still don't need to cleanse. So I'm just going to keep going into... Oh, I do anyway. I think to push up my uh, Stene to try and kill the AOL. Oh, I don't Soul Burn. It does 4 damage. I think this AOL has like 20k HP. Yeah, so it's not high effectiveness. Uh, and boy, it sure showed. Uh, but let's... <laughs> let's provoke the... Um... The Lilias and reset my attack buff on my Stene. Arwell, everyone's still pretty healthy. Uh, just gonna keep attacking into <laughs> into AOL. They still haven't even broken half HP um, on on Lilia, which is hilarious to me. Um, I hit Rylet with that one, but I'm not really tempted to kill him. To, like, attempt to kill him. I'd rather just get rid of AOL. Um, let's try sleeping the Lilias. No more Vigor buff at the moment. They can stun Laia again if they so choose, but she's still a ticking time bomb. And Rylet cannot soul burn. Whoops. Rylet cannot soul burn his attack because Bunny Dom exists, which is great. 
Uh, so let's try working on the Seal Elias, because she's the next biggest pain in the butt. Rylet can ask three here, but again, 31k HP Laia and 32k HP Johan Aureus. It's not going to do enough. So let's sleep see Lilius. So unless they get a dual attack, which they did, which was very scary, uh, I'm just going to go ahead and kill Lilias. Bonk. And then kill Arwell. Turns out to be a counter Arwell, which is fine. And then, yeah, it doesn't matter at this point. Laia's S3 or Yolha's S3 kills Rylet, and that's if I don't hit him with Stene. So Arwell's dead. Now it's Rylet versus an entire team of bulk. They S1, great, and then they go into Bunny Dom, so rip Bunny Dom. You did your, you did your part. But yeah, like now, now what do you do? Stene also still has skill null. And eventually I'll hit, or I'll just, you know, kill through evasion. <laughs> and there goes Rylet. They would have had a, a, a tough time getting to Stene. We got two more to show, because I've been doing really well. Uh, there's another Cleave team. So Stene, or not Stene, Zio. He's going to push back Sage Ball, so Sage Ball doesn't sleep everybody, as is his want. Uh, again, Sage just gets pushed back, doesn't get silenced, just gets pushed back. Because that's the only thing he knows how to do. Uh, Ran is going to S2, S3. It does look like it's a higher HP Ran. They're going to Soul Burn. They hit Aiden because Aiden is a trash unit. That's going to proc. DDR is on Soul Consultation, which is fine. Um, because they have to make a choice here. And that choice they make is go into Genoa. And the answer to that question is attempt to stun him. They don't have Soul Burn, though. Do they risk it? They do. No stun. So Genoa gets, understandably, very angry. Which is great for me, because now DDR gets to die. So let's go ahead and kill DDR. <laughs> there he goes. Karina, I'm just gonna S3, because why not? Just try to kill the Zeo with splash damage. Doesn't quite kill, but Aiden, even though she's blind and dumb and an idiot and can't dodge for garbage, uh, still has enough power to take out Zeo. And now, Genoa is protected. And they quit. And then we got one more, because I've been on a streak. Uh, this one's against Polly, Carmen, Laia, Stene, and Solitaria. I go for Genoa, Karina, LRK, Shu, and Laika. They get rid of Laika. I get rid of Solitaria. Because again, there's a lot of splash damage here with Shu, Genoa, and Karina. So Stene's not that far out of reach. They're going to S2 push everybody up. I'm okay with that. It depends if this um, Polly is um, degen or not. Not really, but they're more scared of the shoe, which is fine. She's going to get stunned here. Polly's just going to S3. I'm okay with that. It's going to unbuffable probably everybody. Yeah. 
So it is a degen poly based on it being, you know, 16k HP. Uh, so let's go ahead and start working on this Carmen. Will they S3? So they don't end up s 3 they just want to control the shoe, which is understandable. Um, LRK is going to S3. Uh, it puts immunity up on just the Karina because she resisted the poly. Um, but if we can get rid of the Carmen, I think we're looking pretty good. Uh, they go into Genoa, which procs uh, Polly with Karina, and then Genoa procs, which is pretty nice. So he's going to push up. And now we can... I'm just going to attempt to kill... Yep, I'm going to kill Carmen. Do some splash damage to... to everybody. And Karina can S3 soon, so I think they have to... I think they soul burn to try and stun the... No, they just try to stun the Karina. They get a miss, though. No dice. They're gonna soul burn, hit Genoa, hit Shu, hit Shu again. But I'm okay with this. We're just gonna go into Polly. Start working her down. And then I'm going to punch this Polly in the face. Does end up being counter. It does stun me before it explodes. And now it's just Laia, but that's what Genoa loves. Soulburn, greater attack buff. Get out of here, wench. So this is a long, whoops, this is a long appetizer, but, ah, uh, god, he's just been hard carrying me, and it's so good, it's so fun. Um, hell, why not, I'll do a, I'll do a live fight. That way I can ruin my streak of six games, six wins, for you. <laughs> oh, yep, we're fighting... Probably Ellis Cat again, <laughs> but I think all of the, oh, I think all of the legends have the same frame, so that we don't know who they are. Sharoon and DDR, okay. So let's go with. Uh, Flitica and a Flitica and Zeo. Ran, sure. I'm gonna go for Ed and let's see here. Who's good here? I mean, I could go for Aiden. We might get rid of DDR. Sure, I'll get rid of DDR. Um, their only real damage is Polly. I assume this is a damage Polly. So I'm just gonna push her back. Because if Ran wants to S3 and hit Aiden, I'm fine with that. 
They're just gonna hit Flitica. That's fine. Sleeper, killer. Yep. They're probably gonna soul burn stun Genoa. Yep. Wow, they're gonna... They hit Aiden because Aiden again is a trash unit. So I think I would have won this game if Aiden had dodged anything, as per usual. <laughs> yeah, because Aiden would have killed... Aiden doesn't dodge. Uh, Aiden would have killed Polly before she was able to do anything. But Aiden doesn't dodge. <sighs> I need to stop relying on that bitch. She can't do anything. Mine can't do anything. If I dodge there, I just win because I have attack buff. I kill Polly with the S3 or with the S2. And then I kill Sharoon or I kill Ran and then they have no damage. And then I, I win. God, I hate Aiden so much. Anyway, bye. Love you. <laughs>